Hello and welcome to 1987 here. We're at Charlotte and of course in the 87 Legends. So we are going to head up here. It's Legacy Charlotte. I don't know if I mentioned that. Uh, not just regular Charlotte. We're heading up for qualifying. And uh, I've done this combo before, but not since they changed uh, the handling characteristics of the car. I imagine um, tire saving still probably going to be a pretty big thing, even though the tires don't wear quite like they used to. Um, Charlotte's usually a track you want to keep the tires happy, so that's what I'm going to try to do. I've put my brake bias way back, and that should be okay, because I'm just going to use a bit, a little bit of uh, brakes to get this thing uh, turned. And hopefully shouldn't pitch myself sideways. The only thing I'm a little concerned about is uh, if we get green flag pit stops, which green flag, green I'm also going to practice okay. after this. And we'll see uh, how that goes. But uh, really wanting to get things right. Okay, well. <laughs> already blown it. I was saying I really want to get things right on the first lap. Because the tires wear so quickly, and then I overdrew it. So that's pretty cool. Gotta love it. <laughs> Hopefully it's still an okay lap, and we'll go ahead and try, see if we can be any faster the second lap, but probably gonna be tough to do. Yeah, you could just, it's just, Already down a tenth, and I feel like I took that probably about the same, probably overdrove it still. Even though I drove it a little softer, it still looks the same because uh, less grip on the tire. So, I guess we'll live with it. It's not too far off, about a, a tenth off of uh, what I was running in practice, so uh, I'll survive. Should be okay. Dang, 31.8, pretty nice lap right there by the floor. So, that'll be fine. I don't think we're going to fall too much. Right, just a couple spots. And then we will try a green flag pit stop here. See how that works out. Just got to be really careful. This is my brake bias being back. Oh, I don't know, man. Obviously, that was speeding. But if I was getting on the brakes anymore, it was going to get sideways. So, I think what I might have to do is remember to change it in car. I usually don't do that because I don't trust myself to remember, but I really want to get as much turn as possible on braking. And I really don't want to sacrifice too much on pit entry either if we have to get there. So I am tasking myself to remember and hopefully I will. We are uh, back to P6 now. On the leaderboard. Uh, we should have enough time to go around one more time and then do another practice. I'm gonna again try 42% just to see if I can figure it out. Definitely not gonna drive quite this hard into the corners during the race. So I don't get run over from behind. So I do really want to save the tires. Okay, you know what? That's not so bad. Ugh. It's just if I have to get on the brakes hard, you could see how much it pulled sideways. Pit box. Hmm. Ten. Port? Oh, they were having a conversation, I think. Um, I just muted it so I could do the intro. Okay, seventh place. That's not so bad. We're on the inside. That's cool. So we got a 2.6 strength of field. It's kind of surprised we had a race going. I guess it's because it helps out that it's a free track. And it is Monday night, but emphasis on night. And that's why I was a little surprised that a series that has not as much participation had a nice, healthy amount of sign-ups. In fact, did it split? I think it might have. So, 
actually got a split here. In fact, I know it did. I know there was more than 19 people, so we actually got a split. That's the end of the session. P7. So that's pretty cool. Hopefully you get some green flag racing. Is that modified? That means the brake bias changes have stuck. And we'll get in the car. One lap to green. You'll be lining up on the inside. Pit road is Can I adjust right this? Now. Oh, that's an option. If you can't even adjust it, and there's only a fixed series for this. I guess there's the winter NIS. They have like a open setup for that, don't they? So I guess there's that. So, P7, number three car. Um, should probably get like a top five if I want to gain like I rating or whatever. But I'm fine if I finish outside of the top five too. Let's see, we got 19 people. I guess, I guess top 10 would be fine. I think I can do better than that though, but we'll see. I want to be overconfident. Have a clean race, get a top 10 at minimum. That, that's probably a good goal. So we'll, we'll shoot for that. Session last lap. White Dale Senior. Uh, we're talking about Dale Senior. Are we going to have aggressive people in this race? That's the first thing I think of when I hear that that's what they were talking about. Everyone wants to be Dale or and believe it or not, nobody is. Shocking, I know. There are two we'll real quick before we start. Alright, I'm ready to go. Good luck everybody. Follow car number zero. Right. In the inside column. I did a uh, Milwaukee Mile race last week, but I didn't get it uploaded in time before the next week. It's kind of old news now. Maybe I'll upload it at some point in the week, whenever I don't have something else to upload. But I just never got around uh, putting it out there, and uh, it's kind of old news if <laughs> the, tr the track has changed and all that. So, I don't know. Can I get a mic check? Gotcha. Thank you. I just changed that dead, so I wanted to know. Hi, good luck, everyone. Uh oh, the cat's trapped in the bathroom. Gee, <laughs> he knows he's best. Like, press He'll the get help. Before you talk, right? <laughs> I'm really terrible at it, to be honest. Oh, I know. <laughs> Honestly, actually, it doesn't make sense. We're going to turn you down. Get that clutch figured out. <laughs> huh? <laughs> I'm confused. I'm confused, too. I don't know what he's talking about. Carrying me down out the race? I don't know what that means. Maybe he's trying to say that he's... Car outside. He's going to put up uh, through outside tech inspection, yeah. Probably complimenting uh, his Q lap in a roundabout way. Sit in. I think these guys are overdriving a little bit. Gonna let him go on by. Clear outside. So I don't want this car to get tight and undrivable later. Tenth position. We are gonna try to get some rotation. With the brakes. Seems okay. Got a little bit of room behind us. That's nice. Just really hope they don't run me over. Happy with how this is feeling right now. They're pulling away, but I, I feel like they're just I feel like they're overdriving a little bit up there. But we'll see. Yeah, 
All right, keeping it to the bottom. I think that's where we want to be. Save tire. That's the fastest lap of the race. And we'll just take it nice and slow. Let the race come to us. Hopefully the tires will get the speed for us later. That guy nearly overdrives it into the back of us mid-corner. That's what I'm telling you. People love to run into the back of you whenever you're saving tires. So, you don't have to watch out, I guess, a little bit. I'm just uh, riding here, Tyler. You want by? Let me know. Okay, they are too wide behind us. Hopefully that'll give us a little bit of room. Got some smoke. Is that the Mac tonight? Car getting sideways? Didn't quite see what it was. Use those brakes to get turned without turning my wheel. Oh my god, 16 is almost coming up to get 10 in the quad oval. They're both over driving. They have fallen off a little bit compared to us, it looks like. Clear outside. So hopefully we'll start moving forward a bit. There's another Colton in the race, by the way. And any time that happens, you know I gotta try to beat them. <laughs> oh my god, don't run me over, please. I make a little nervous. But we're okay. Killing those tires. Get a good run. Outside. Go ahead and take it. Still there, hold your line. P8. Still there, hold your line. Clear up top. Feeling alright. Is he going to run into the back of me now? Slowly inching forward, and it's only nine laps in now. So that's a pretty good sign. Still a long way to go. We're sideways up there. The nine was repeatedly talking about how he's going to rattle people's cages, and it looks like that's what he's doing. He's just constantly getting in the back of them. So there's your Dale Earnhardt. Never mind the fact he's in a Mac tonight car. He's like wrecking people in practice too. So, yeah, he's just gonna do it some more. Very cool of him. That guy's pretty stupid. This car is out. Line up single file behind car number zero six. So there goes that. Dude, those brake checkers in the corner the whole time. I don't, I don't know why you're letting off so early, but that's not the line. And you just wrecked him, dude. Yeah, you were saving tires. We were losing <laughs> half a second to the leader. Fucking the entire time. Not the line. <laughs> We were, we were we were saving tires. Tire. Go around him, not through him. Then I don't understand.
Yeah, whatever. You don't know. Pit road's open. This guy it's makes open. me mad. He's freaking talking about JD, rattling people's cage. Your cage was rattled. Uh, I rattled someone's cage. Someone's someone cage. cage. This guy's a moron, so. Lead car's pitting. That sucks. Pit lane speed limit is 50 miles per hour. We think we'll need to stop again. Pit box team, 10. It's freaking going so slow. Five. Oh, I was going to pit, but y'all made it a parking lot. One. Right here. Fuck. Sorry. That's awesome. Ah, dude, whatever. whatever. I'm, I'm over it. Can't fight car. Tires weren't even that bad. I'm glad he's over it, since uh, he's the one that caused it. We're done. Get going. You only have one tire set remaining. Somehow, I still didn't fetch the mic. After all that, but. It's fine. We are still just gonna have to be patient anyway. Zero point nine gallons. I'm gonna save some fuel. Tan's comment was stupid too. If you're saving tires, get out of the way. No. <laughs> you do not. You are not obligated to get out of anybody's way. I mean, I didn't intentionally wreck you though. I was on the brake the entire time. <sighs> Shouldn't get involved. He's probably going to find any reason to wreck me if I start, so... When did I not brake for the corner? I was braking when I was normally braking. He just chose to brake 100 feet early. Guy is incredibly stupid. <laughs> oh my god. I have to be right behind him, of course. Get ready, going green. Ice car is off. Be ready. Green, green, green. I'm gonna go or what? What is happening? Outside. Clear high. You're in the top ten. You're gonna say I don't know how to race all of I think you got something coming to you. Clear high. I wouldn't wreck somebody and then threaten somebody. But that's just me. Are you his butt buddy or something? <sighs> no, I'm um, the victim of this. So. Probably for the best, I had a bad start because of that accordion thing. Because I don't know if I want to be near that whatever his number is, nine, I think. Nine. We're just still uh, saving tires. Hope nobody comes up behind me and wrecks me because I'm not allowed to do that. Uh, sorry for getting your panties in a twist, but uh, I have a race to go do so. He's so cool. You got him. Look at that. No one no, else no, up no, here is breaking 100 feet early. early. What a miracle. The yellow flag is out. Line up single file. Pit road is closed. He just completely, completely lose it by himself. The pace car's out. Up, Line up car. single file behind car number zero eight. The pace car is out. Pits are closed.
Well, now we get to pay some more. Sounds like someone just looped it in the back. Really hope we get a long run. Let's I would really like to do that. I feel like we've got good long run pace potentially. Don't continue the argument. He's going to say more stupid things. And I'm going to have to listen to it with my ears. I mean, I could mute it, I guess, but... <sighs> what else am I going to do under caution, I guess? Keep typing, dude. You got the whole Discord laugh at. Zero point five gallons. Save a little bit more fuel. We should be okay, though, I think. Zero point two gallons. Zero point two. Yeah, we, I think we'll be okay. Um, um. I guess it's something to I mean, do. If, you, if you're going to make assumptions make like that, that I, I don't know. That, you got yeah, something else coming to you. People, people make mistakes, mistakes but, but, I mean, I feel like you're probably in the wrong, so. Racing into the get Oh my god. Man, he types fast. He must be really angry. He's typing like light speed. We established five minutes ago that you were breaking early for the corn. Guess we could just embrace it and laugh. <laughs> uh, This is the most... <laughs> I've never seen someone get the panties in this more. That's the only thing he knows how to say. I have, I have thoroughly rattled his cage. He noticed it too, he does type best. I don't know why that has any correlation with that, but... Congratulations. Anyway, does anyone, anyone else want to play a drinking game anytime he starts complaining or just take a shot? This guy was talking about drinking games and like practice too. I don't know. I feel like he might be one of those pull string dolls that has like a few sayings and then pull the string and it, he just rattles one off. Like, pull the string, rattle his cage. Pull the string, panties in a twist. One left to green. Get ready. Line up on the outside. Like good. <laughs> uh, okay, that was fun. Time flies when you're whatever that was. We have a lot of space between people here. So happen to notice. Not sure what that's about. Guess we're bunching up at the end here. Come on, why can't we do restarts? Terrible at restarts. Outside. Clear high.
Uh, remember, still got a lot of laps to deal with here, so can't just roast the tires off. Still got to have a plan. You're in the top position. Ten. I feel like we're probably not going to go green for all that long, though, with some of the people in this race. We'll see. Eight's still kind of overdriving the corner behind us, so that scares me a bit. He doesn't blame me if he gets into the back of me, like some people would do. Not into the back of me. Car outside. That lap was a 33.0. Still there, hold your line. Really uh, unsettled on braking. Hopefully, able to hold on to that. It's that 42% brake bias. Gotta be careful with that. Careful with that. That's a deadly weapon. Is that the quote, Buzz Lightyear? I don't remember. Something like that. Speaking of, uh... Three recorded phrases. P9. The car in front of us is now Farrell. Keeping a consistent pace. Feeling alright. What happened? No. No cautions. Please. Heinz. Intentionally wrecking? I don't... Outside. Clear outside. I, I can't explain that. That was very obviously intentional. <sighs> if I was trying to win a race, I would have been out. But that's just... Why did that look so intentional? I indeed okay, have been out on purpose. Only the most talented of spin out. Strategy. Still there, hold your line. I wonder what Discord is saying now. Keep low. Clear out. I don't. <sighs> he just admitted to intentional wrecking, so. Oh god, that guy's still here. <laughs> I still are gonna be yelling or kind of like complaining at each other during the race. I mean, it worked out for us, so that feels kind of rotten though. I don't really want to gain spots because people had to check up for garbage pail kid over here. Outside. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Keep low. Got it. Dude, I came in here for fun, though. I imagine he did too before you wrecked him. Bet well, he was probably having some fun. having a blast. Fucking Monday night. I raced super. Kinda 
Oh, Saif's fighting hard, by the way. Just gonna wait for his tires to wear out too much. Of course, he's a guy that was like, oh, if you're gonna save tires, get out of the way. So I imagine he's not been saving his tires at all. Driving in a little harder there, because I uh, figured if he would hit me, it would have been my fault, so. Let's see what happens when we save tires. So we're up in the top five, top four actually with that pass. Are we going to get hit from behind here? No? Okay, we're good. We're good. It's almost getting a little loose on exit. Uh, that's okay with me. Ever since the update though, this thing kind of can get weird. Like, really loose if it gets loose, so I'm, I am going to have to watch out a little bit. We have a bit of a gap up to the first couple of guys. We'll see if we can cut into that at all. But, I'm not going to push it. Just going to let the car come to me. Let the speed come from the tire advantage rather than trying to force anything to happen. We've got what looks like a lap car battling a lead lap car. Is that what I'm seeing? That's pretty cool too, I guess. Got some interesting things going on in this race. I don't know, I haven't been paying attention. I just happened to see they were side by side for like a lap. And then I was like, wait, that guy's name is Blue. Slap down. Hopefully we don't have to deal with him too long when we catch him. Yes. Sly comment from the one guy coming up. Unless he's already left and I didn't notice. Well, don't want to get in a last remark now that he's gone and can't say anything back. Seems like the type of thing that would happen. Glad we're all very mature here, right? Ha 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 ha. Anyway, we're in fourth. Gaining on P2 and 3. That's good consistency. Keep it up. Car outside. Really got an advantage. Feeling good about how this is going. Tons more grip. Stay low. Clear outside. So, four to the leader, 3.1 to P2. 3.2. <laughs> now in third was our 53.8. Let's uh, see if we can do anything about that. Hey, the other Colton has been following me up here, apparently. Uh-oh. Come on now, I gotta be the best Colton on the race. Can't let that slip from me. Can't be having that now. You've just done a 33.7. Oh, wow, we're not actually even good on fuel. That's interesting. Oh, God. Why is he on track? Going slow. I hope he doesn't bring out a caution. What's making this fun is the long run. We're gaining on both the leader and P2. If you bring out a caution, I'm going to be upset. This other Colton sketching me though, he's saved even better than I have. So well done to him. 
Well, credit. It's done a great job. We're soon going to find out if... Oh, thank God he's gone. We're soon going to find out if uh, this lap car is... I did it as obnoxious or a <laughs> I think it's the uh, comment I was waiting for. Sorry for the dive for, I wasn't meaning to do that. I'm like drafting this guy. This guy's not necessarily slow. He's not really holding me up. I never drove it because I was following him. Get by him. All is well. Zero point eight gallons. I think we can save that much, so I think we're okay. I think we're okay on fuel. We're being hounded by a Colton though. That's a little concerning for my bottom line. <laughs> Stick to it. If he tries to pass, I'm definitely going to make it easy on him and let him go. I would rather not battle for position, hurt both of our tires, waste both of our time, and uh, make things worse for both of us. So um, I will let him go nice and easy if necessary. So we have 3.1 to the liter, just changed to 2.6 to P2. I think P2 is catching the liter as well. Looks like it. So they could end up battling as well, and that could help us. This is uh, getting pretty interesting. The greatest corner there. Just a little bit of time. Still catching. 2.7 to the liter. I feel like uh, with those guys so close to each other as well, they're going to want to be pushing even harder. Trying to get distance from one another. It's uh, just generally very helpful for us. If they, uh, they start getting into a fight. There's a car directly behind the guy behind, but uh, that's just that lap car. So, got a gap before the next person that's on the lead lap. This is really cool. I really hope this goes green all the way. Really like how this is turning out. Really, really. I would really like the word really, I guess. 0 0.5 gallons. 0 0.5. So that is uh, falling at a good enough pace that we should be okay. Good consistency. Keep them coming. Lap car up ahead, switching lanes. 
Is that going to mess with those guys at all? Perhaps. Looks like it might have. Thirteen having a great run behind us. Maybe the Coltons can join forces. <laughs> I mean, he hasn't, like, tried to dive bomb me or anything, or even really tried to pass. So maybe he's content. He knows we're on the way forward. Things are looking good for us, so don't do that. <laughs> Lap car in front of me. Don't do that. Is he going low? Car outside. Still there. All right. I don't think that affected our corner at all. He didn't even have a run. That was just a dive bomb. Oh, we're dive bombing back there. That's not good for green flag racing. If we're uh, throwing those. How to run? Have to do that. They're getting closer. Still almost thirty laps to go. Still got time. getting draft I see he's getting draft from that lap car that's helping him out a little bit we'll get there too though have our turn It still feels pretty good. It's doing what I need it to do. Okay, Colton. That's good consistency. Keep it up. Other Colton still hanging on behind us. Now we've got some draft. lap car in the wall, that's a little concerning. As is this 18 being very outside. slow off the corner. Fortunately messed up my outside. exit. Still kind of powered through alright though. They are right next to each other up there now. Right into my hand. <laughs> Outside. Clear high. It's an exit. Just gonna have to keep an eye on that. Make sure that's not getting too bad. Point eight ahead. Tires seem to have plateaued a little bit. We aren't gaining as much as we were in the past. Especially when I overdrive the corner. 
sliding on exit. That's not ideal. Right, he is being patient behind, though. That is basically confirmation. I'm actually going to drive a little bit harder on entry, maybe. Try to get uh, the right front. I don't know. Is that what I want to do? I'm going to do it anyway. Oh my god. Turn one's feeling weird now. Turn's doing some weird things in turn one at this point. Is he going to go for it? Car inside. Sorry, Jack. Yeah. Right, that's cool. Still there, inside. Go on. Inside. All right. <laughs> I made a couple mistakes, so it's understandable. I'll uh, follow him now. That lap was at 34.6. He might be faster. Kind of pulled away <laughs> through turn one. I think he's better at saving tires than I am. Why can't I be the best Colt in this race? <laughs> it's just not fair. Well, shoot, dude. Bring me to him. Wait for me. Those are the buddy jam. Jam. Figure out what he's Thank doing you. different, possibly here. It's just got better tires, I think. So my tires aren't so good no more. I think I might need to be just a little more gentle on throttle. Be more gradual with it instead of slamming on it. Probably put me in a better spot. And that was a better lap. I gotta do more of that. Kinda just lost my, uh, my marks, I think. Gotta get them back. It's getting a little closer to the end of the race. It's definitely unfortunate that we're no longer moving forward, it seems like. But if I end up P4, that's perfectly fine. We are the three car. And that is within the top five, which is very nice. That was at 34.0. Something happened up there. I think that red car up there tried to take the high line, and it did not grip for him. Unless he was just trying to get a run, and that was all intentional. It didn't look like it gripped very well, though. That makes things very interesting. That's going to help the uh, 13 in front of us get into his draft a little more. I will continue being in the 13's draft could be very beneficial for us. Boy! Fifteen to go. Six seconds back to the next guy on our lap. So no pressure behind. Ooh, the 13's pushing hard. He almost got the wall. He's giving it everything he's got. I'm like rooting for the 13 more than myself, to be honest. He's having a great run. Like, we started like right next to him. He saved tires better than us. And he's... We straight up passed us. Now he's on his way to the lead.
and in the dust. He's got more speed than both those guys up there. I just gotta get around him. Sorry. No cautions, please. I'm very, very interested in seeing how this plays out. One's in the wall. Drive it gradual on the throttle. Is he making his moves? Not quite yet. the leader in the wall. I think he was. If not, I think he was very close to 13 making a move on the inside. I am just as much a spectator as a, part a participant right now in this one. What a great race. We got 11 to go. And they are under a blanket for the lead. And uh, guess what? I'm almost there too. Well within the draft now, ten to go. Great job, ten to go. Last lap was at thirty-four point zero. Going for the lead, the thirteen. The top two guys are being bombarded by Coltons. <laughs> Oh, this is great. The two has fallen from first all the way to third. The car in front is Bradley. You pull it away. The gap behind is now 8.1. Check up for him a little bit here. Don't get the run. Just had to wait for him a little bit. Massive run, gotta find a way to take this. Inside. Stay high, there's a car on the low side. Still there, inside. We haven't done the middle line yet, but we gotta do it. Still inside. Get enough of a run off. Caution, yellow flag. Oh. Are you Close. kidding me? Close. I'm, I'm sorry for I wasn't trying to do that to you. It's <sighs> closed. Hate to see that. That was some really good racing here up in the top four. Oh, Jim, what happened? Man, that sucks. I kind of saw that one coming 20 laps ago. The 16 just kept dive bombing. I know you didn't do it on purpose, but they tried to dive bomb from the car length back. And got in me. I can't take two tires. Oh, that sucks, buddy. You got plenty of fuel. Unfortunately. I mean, it's just a learning experience. You just gotta. Pete Road is now open. You gotta have a run. You can't just dive bomb like that, or that's gonna be the result. Maybe we can have a legendary pit stop. AKA everyone takes two tires and we only take <laughs> and we and we take four. And then we come out last. Five. Three. Two. One. Right here. Don't overshoot the box. Alright. Nailed it. Seventy one sixty six. Very happy with that.
curious what others are uh, that they got theirs at. Seventy fifty three. Wow, interesting. So he actually was too hard on the the rear. It sounds like terrible, 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 terrible. We're good. We're good. That's it for tires. Make them last the rest of the race. They want you in single. Come out in the same order. It looks like. I don't know if I have very much. Short run speed. I don't know if I know how to get around here on uh, at full blast. Catch up to cars. That guy's giving left sides too. I guess that is kind of a thing in this car. It's really bad on the right front though. Hey man, let's take it as a learning experience. We just can't dive from that far back. You gotta have a little bit of a run, or that's what's gonna happen. I'm not mad. Frustrated, but not mad. <laughs> but I'm not mad, just disappointed. Learn from it to go. <laughs> and improve. That's worse than being mad. That's all you can do. Yeah, man, you know, you know you're, you're totally, totally right. right. Um, I, was I was getting, getting a little race brain, brain there. With only a few laps left, I should have been throwing it in my bag. You're right. Let's talk to the 15. Yeah, it's all good. We all make mistakes, and we all learn from mistakes. <laughs> this is the oh, most saccharine thing. Like. <laughs> and it seems like, saccharine you know, over there. you did, and you'll learn and I don't know how to say it, but it's super. It's all math for. I have diabetes now. But oh, that's nice though. Everyone being friendly. It's Mostly right, Jim. Man. Jim's always super friendly every race I've been in with him. Lap car. Gonna be sent to the back, I believe. Is it four lap shootout? Three lap shootout, I think? Three lap shootout. Wow, All right. <laughs> No green white checkers in this series either. Okay, it does get sent to the back, right? Yeah. Pass that eighteen, Yeah. To the back with ye. Glad I didn't take two tires, because those left sides, uh, I was just probably going to spin right through the first corner. So, glad I made that decision. I hope this doesn't uh, blow up on all our faces. I, mean, I was really rooting for the other Colton, too. I don't know if he's going to be able to get it done in a short run, but... Green. The pace car is in. Green, green, green. Come on. I hate you. You're in the middle. Percy three making wide. me three wide. Two wide. Still there at the bottom. Stay high. Nah. Nah. Clear. Oh no. Something got the wall. Two left to go. Two to go. Two laps left. That lap time was 33.9. I don't know how to go short run here. I think those guys are definitely just going to be faster than me. The one and the two. We'll see about the 13. He's going to try again for a pass. On the white flag. I think it's a race of who is the fastest Colton. It's point. Hmm. Not get that corner right.
Good win. P4. And good race, good win. Good result, mate. Well done. Chicken that sucks. I think I would have had P2 had that gone green. Great job. You did really well. Good race, y'all. A lot of fun. All right, we'll go ahead and get out. Oh, good car. We're going to have to go with Vicky back up. Just send a nice message. Tell him I was rude for him. <laughs> You did a very, very good job. Better than I did. So, we got P4 though. That's still pretty good. And, uh, I, I'll take that for sure. I wasn't, I wasn't quite certain what I was gonna. I was just falling earlier, really, yeah. Uh, type. <laughs> So, we will check out the incidents. Not too many overall. We had a very nice uh, long run there. Near the end. That's not fresh tires. Maybe a little. Hard to say. I sure did a lot of yelling for having done five. Yeah, he sure did dump the five. Glad we were... I mean, just how on earth is that anybody else's fault? I should have done last. <laughs> yeah, I'm just glad I didn't get to the back of them. So the nine dumps the five, and then somehow it's everybody else's fault but his. He's just one of those people. You see him all the time. Somehow he fits his big head inside his race car. So, uh, him doing that hurts a bunch of people. I just realized my statement had a bit of a <laughs> double meaning. Just glad I was able to avoid getting into the back of anyone. I wasn't meaning to throw shade at certain people, but uh, I think the 15 just shifted down to like wood first or something and blew his engine. That was weird. Don't know what we're seeing there. Nineteen looping it. He must have gotten the apron or something, right? No. He had to really overdrive that to make that happen. I'm not even sure how you do that. Maybe just driving in really hard and then getting on the brakes too hard. Oh, man. Up and over. Hot dang. <laughs> so, that was quite the wreck. He's still going, though. He's got roof damage. You don't need your roof to go fast. Extra weight is all that is. So I don't know if the fives out here, like, with a broken car, trying to eventually get to the uh, nine. Or just uh, rolling around. I didn't know he came back out, though. Oh, my God. That was, uh, well, that didn't stick at all, did it? He enters real low, very low. 
and then it's the apron and it comes all the way up the track. Well, that wasn't uh, that wasn't too great. I mean, I guess it wasn't intentional. It, maybe he's like on a controller or something. It's just how quickly, like, like that. Like this car does not respond that quickly. So I feel like that's like maybe he's on a controller or something. Like I wasn't trying to accuse him. I literally just it looked legitimately like he did it on purpose. Like he's overdriving it. I guess that's how he gets sideways. But then like he's fine. He gets loose again. I guess the tires got hot. And he just loops it. I wasn't trying to accuse him. I just it literally looked like he did it on purpose. But I guess he didn't. I didn't see him sliding at all first. I guess he's still doing it under caution. Uh, just wanted to rattle his own cage, I guess. Well, into the wall, and he's going on a journey. Do we get any cool ramps? Uh, spoil sport, going back on the track. You're supposed to go full speed into the ramps. I'm trying to have entertainment here. We're moving along, though. After a couple of people happen to leave the race, imagine that. Get to go green for a while. Ten laps forward. Got just a blink, not even anything right there. More blinking, I assume. Sure what's happening there. Is that blocking? Maybe not. He has to really let off. And then, like, he kind of looked like a block. I don't know. Maybe he just didn't turn into the quad level quite right, but... 17 had a huge run. Not sure what we're seeing there. Nothing, I guess. Nothing. Oh, wow. Yeah, that 16 really did dump him, huh? Sounds like it had been a couple of close calls already, and then 16 kind of just finished him. I mean, the guy literally is telling people if you want to go by, go by. He straight up ran into the back of him. I mean, can you even call it a butt dive bomb? Because he didn't get below him. He just ran into the back of him. Well, he's not even close to the bottom of the track. I, he just overdrove it, I guess. Obviously, I don't think it was on purpose, but it wasn't very well done. Unfortunately, Jim gets a... Uh... Oh, hey, Mike uh, recognizes me. That's cool. Just finishing up the incidents here. Not sure, not much going on there. And then uh, this is uh, coming to the end. Awesome. Yeah, I think this was a pretty good one overall. It definitely started rocky with some of the weirdness going on. People arguing and everything, but that's kind of entertaining in its own way. Oops. Gotta on the click the text box and then uh Finish up the incidents here. Oh, 
Is this white flag? We got someone running into someone? Or is this after the race? This is after the race. He might have been mad. <laughs> I don't know. We got we got beef. So, I don't know if there was a history or what, but uh, this guy just straight up plowed through him at the end. That was kind of curious. Yeah, he really dumped him hard. So, maybe there was something that happened earlier I wasn't happy about, or maybe he just wasn't expecting him to uh, slow down so much. But I think that's probably going to do it. Sure is. So, hey, shout out to Mike for saying hello. Caution actually gave me two more places. Very well. So very nice finish for him. It's a 17 for sure. And, uh, I guess that's going to do it for this one. I appreciate you watching. A uh, bit of a longer one as these 87s tend to be, but I think there's plenty to see here. Lots of intrigue with the long green run, reeling them in. And uh, got ourselves a nice finish, so... I appreciate you, hope you have a good one, and I will see you next time.